Alright everybody, welcome to Fireside Chats with Gaslight. Today we have Bo. He is going to answer some of my questions. And Hello I'll... everybody. Hope you're excited. So Let's do it. Yeah. Bo, how did you end up getting into web design? Well, well, Katie, it was a it was quite a while ago, I guess. Um, <laughs> My first website I ever designed was in high school back in, Ooh. I think, 97 or 98. Oh. Um, uh, yeah, I dated myself a little bit, I guess. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was doing uh, an Angel Fire site. I don't know if anybody remembers that, but I did I had to do I some do. basic HTML. It was before CSS, or at least uh, before I was introduced to CSS. Mm -hmm. And I um, uh, made a, a website for my band. Nice. Um, in high school and then um jump forward a few years uh I, I took photography classes in high school I never took art classes but um i did uh did photography and was majoring in college in photography um then took a break and got a job as a graphic designer uh at a uh, pretty large church down where i was living in florida and uh was terrible had no clue what i was doing um was not a very good designer and was really just thrown into the fire. Mm -hmm. And uh, while I was there, my first year, um, I was asked to design the website. Oh. Okay. What that looked like was making a Photoshop document that was then cut up into ta uh, into like segments that were put into a table layout, like I mean, old school HTML table layout. Um, and it was terrible and ugly. And I <laughs> basically sent the Photoshop document to an IT person. They chopped it up and put it in these tables, and um, I was really ashamed uh, <laughs> to have anything to do with it. And so that's when I started learning CSS and HTML, nice. and um, was able to ramp up pretty quickly and uh, started learning some JavaScript. Um, and then, yeah, I, I went on to work for a university for for uh, multiple years, doing web design. Um, kind of was doing all kinds of stuff. Um, I was with a, a smaller organization in the, within the university, and so. I was doing the web design, the graphic design, um, and some video work, um, nice. but then really wanted to more focus just on the web, and mm -hmm. so went to a, another um, company and worked on their in, in their in-house team and learned to work with um, Python and Django, um, and then was doing more uh, uh, CSS preprocessor work with SAS and kept growing, and then eventually came here to Gaslight. Um, uh, so yeah, nice. Man, you're the fancy man who knows all of the things then. Uh, I did all the things. I didn't say I was good at them. <laughs> I guess there's a, I bet you could do them well, better than I can. Um, all right, so you ended up here at Gaslight, and we are very happy about that. Um, now, what is your favorite part about Gaslight? Favorite part about Gaslight? Oh, mm -hmm. that's hard because there's so many great things. I know, I know, but I believe in you to pick one. <laughs> um, I, I have to say, I, I, it's definitely the people, but I'll say specifically, it's how we structure our teams. Mm -hmm. um, so when I was working at an in-house agency, we had a good relationship with our developers. It was the first time I really got to work um, closely with developers, mm -hmm. um, besides sending them stuff or developing everything myself, um, which wasn't very good either. Um, so. Uh, it, I really how, love how we have our team structured because I get to work um, side by side with the developers on a day to day basis, hourly basis, working on different features, sending things back and forth really quickly. And, uh, and I love our, our teams and I love working with our people. And um, so that's great part of it. But then also I feel like it's a really productive way to get work done. Um, uh, sending, you know, we have the design sandwich, which for those listening that don't know anything about that, we have where we, we, we start off a feature with looking at the design of it. It might just mean us mocking up something, or it might mean talking it over with our developers um, and kind of maybe architecting how this feature is going to work too. Mm -hmm. So it's it's the whole whole design, not just what it looks like. Um, and then we send it over to the developers to build, and then it goes back to the UI for us to clean up on the other end and kind of add in micro interactions or make it really fancy, make the usability mm -hmm. really great. And so it's just a really great work, way to work. So I love our small, mighty teams. It's probably my favorite thing. It hey. definitely is my favorite thing about Gaslight. Wait, there's just a blog post about that. So good plug, hey, though. Perfect. 
Nice. All right. Well, go, go on, read it. Yeah, go. Katie Pullman wrote it, right? Yeah, she did. And there's going to be a part two coming out soon. So. Oh, it's it's going to be good. I know it. It is. All right. Well, Bo, thank you for your time. Those are my my questions of the day. So I appreciate it. Um, All right. And thanks for doing some fireside chats. Thanks for having me, Katie. Thanks, and we are out.